Hi, I'm Ankur Chukla and I'm a participant of the Building AI Products with OpenAI course, which is co-instructed by Siddharth Ramachandran and Ted Sanders. As part of our first course project, we have to create an application which summarizes podcast episodes for busy listeners and provides a summary so that the consumers can decide whether they want to uh, listen the full po podcast or not. And this is a walkthrough of my work uh, around this topic and what has been my approach and thought process behind building this kind of a product. So let's understand the problem first. The problem is straightforward. There are a lot of podcasts, millions of them, and everybody does not have the time uh, and mental bandwidth to go through um, each of them. So they need some kind of a layer on top of uh, the podcast to inform them uh, whether an upcoming episode would interest them or would be worth their time or not. And here are my thoughts around this uh, problem. So the problem revolves around uh, busy users and busy um, is emphasized here. So we're trying to basically provide a time efficient solution to these customers because otherwise it won't make sense to them. Also, there is one very important and keen aspect to this problem that we are converting a passive activity of listening to a podcast to an active activity of reading a podcast summary. Due to this, due to this, there is an increase uh, of the amount of attention or cognitive load the user would have to give to the application in order to make use of that. And that's why we have to try to minimize that load and we have to uh, build this application in such a way that it can provide glanceable information to a user whether a podcast information makes sense to them or not. And that's why the summary which we would provide uh, through this application should not be too long. Uh, otherwise, it makes for very less motivation for the user to read a bulky summary uh, and to decide whether to go for the podcast or not. So the podcast should cater to the following aspects. It should be concise uh, to provide deciding information to the user at a glance. It should give some highlights or nuggets of the episode. It should build upon users liking of episode from within a podcast so that it can help the user in a better manner. This is an important point because uh, any recommendation system should take into consideration users liking or disliking. And then it should engage uh, with the user in a refreshing way. And it might also uh, take feedback from the user. So the solution uh, is basically in the form of two scripts, which is uh, one of them being the backend and the other one being the front end. So the backend application has some functions which uh, are basically hosted on a modal platform, uh, which is a hosted um, GPU service, which can basically containerize and host your uh, Python code um, in a matter of seconds. So all the prompt logic, which basically uses, uh, which basically enables ChatGPT to summarize uh, the podcast episode, then uh, to create uh, extract information about the podcast guest and um, to compare the, so, um, sorry, to get the podcast highlights and to compare the podcast transfer scripts are a part of the script and all the prompts are within the script which is hosted on uh, Moodle. The next part is the, the deployment and which is done using Streamlit. So this is the code for uh, the streamlit part. So let's move on to, uh, to the app and see how things are looking like. So this is a, a simple uh, streamlit app which I have built using the boilerplate code provided by the instructors. And here I have provided 
the first part of uh, the output is basically the uh, podcast summary and i have constrained the uh, chat gpt output to be limited to around 70 words so that the the summary is not too bulky for any user to go through they can quickly uh, read a paragraph and understand whether they want to go for uh, the podcast or not the next important section uh, for a user would be um, the information which tells them what kind of a user is this podcast meant for so here the, uh, this podcast basically uh, uh, deals with the intersection of uh, biology and ai and ml so this podcast is basically recommended for researchers and professionals in the field of machine learning computational biology and clinical medicine and the next section uh, is recommendation based on your favorite podcast so on the right hand side left hand side we can see that we can select uh, one of the uh, podcasts which i have kept pre computed so uh, and and the other drop down basically enables us to select uh, our favorite podcast so this is a way to uh, simulate uh, input to the model that uh, the user already likes uh, one of the two podcasts whether it can be from the indian startup show or it can be from uh, another podcast which is rajiv malhotra's podcast so uh, i have basically uh, took these three examples to illustrate the point that uh, out of these three two uh, two podcast are from the pot uh, from the a startup and uh, sorry uh, one of them is related to ai and machine learning the second one is related to uh, the indian startup ecosystem and the third one is uh, is political in nature right so when we uh, basically choose one of them we get the refreshed podcast summary and there is a function which is called from the front end to the back end which basically compares the um, the transcripts of the selected podcast and compares it to the to the favorite podcast transcript as a reference and gives us a score of recommendation between 1 to 10 higher the score means uh, higher is the chance that the user would uh, like the selected podcast given that uh, the podcast selected in the favorite drop down is their favorite or preferred one so uh, and this score is also augmented by a reason which is which is uh, given by the model which um, is basically its interpretation that uh, about the similarity of or dissimilarity of the two podcast and why uh, would the new podcast appeal to a user or not so when when i change uh, my favorite podcast to rajiv malhotra's podcast which is on um, a debate on uh, rn invasion it basically says the new transcript aligns well with the topic of this a movement of knowledge so it is it is also uh, able to the model is also able to uh, extract the abstract ideas discussed uh, within the podcast and not just uh, superficial uh, and it is not just limited to superficial or uh, strictly the topic uh, which is being discussed in the podcast and at last i provide uh, some key moments uh, from um, the podcast but it is kept at the last because again the key moment section is a, is a time consuming uh, section and um, since the motivation of the application is to uh, cater to busy users i have kept it at the last so this is my submission for the first project uh, within within this course um hope it is received well by the instructors thank you